following a 1-1 draw on the South Coast 11 days ago, Wrexham hosted Brighton in North Wales 24 hours after they were originally set to play, a frozen pitch causing a day's delay to the fixture. But the game didn't take long to warm up, Andy Morell opening the scoring with a delightful curling effort after just 23 minutes. Not bad from the player manager, his eighth goal of the season. But after Gus Poyet's men were outplayed for much of the game, salvation came for the Seagulls in the 77th minute. Ashley Barnes with a well-placed header to restore parity and send the game into extra time. The striker ending a goal drought that had lasted 16 games and stretched back to September. The Blue Square Bet Premier League leaders then went close to edging ahead. Mark Crichton's effort palmed away by Peter Brezovet. There was plenty of power in the header, but the Slovak keeper was in the right place at the right time. Brighton, who'd lost their last three away fixtures, should have gone in front when Torbjorn Egderstein got goal side of his marker, only to be denied by Josle Mayebik. The Cameroon keeper thwarting the Norwegian youngster from close range to keep the score at 1-1. The championship side had another chance to avoid penalties when Will Buckley's cross was met by Roman Vanselot. The Frenchman's well-directed shot was pushed away, though. And with it went Brighton's last chance of winning the game in extra time. For Wrexham, though, incredibly, there was an even later opportunity. With minutes remaining, Glenn Little rolled back the years with a delightful chip to the far post, but Jay Harris saw his point-blank header hit the bar. Wrexham desperately unlucky. Both keepers earned plenty of plaudits during the match, but as the tie went to penalties, only one would enjoy the glory. Wrexham's Dean Keats took the opening spot kick, however, his weak shot was saved by Brezovan. The substitute's effort, a nice height for the keeper, who guessed the right way. Eight successful conversions later, it was left to Craig McHale Smith to put Brighton through. He made no mistake from 12 yards, sending his penalty inuringly down the middle. Few celebrations amongst the Brighton coaching staff and the players. The Seagulls earning a home tie against Newcastle in round four.